OK, um, so let's continue on the oscillators. Uh, we discussed the applications of, of oscillators where we can uh, use them. And uh, basically to build an oscillator, uh, we need two main uh, building blocks. What do you think, Shabab? What do we need to build an oscillator? An amplifier. OK, we need an amplifier. Then. Feedback loop. OK, so we, need, we, we should have feedback and that uh, should be a positive feedback. OK, what else? Haluna, uh, so we, need the we need to have a controlled oscillator. Is you guilty? Abdullah, we need the ball to be in the right hind side of the brain. Uh, you want the ball to be in the right hand side of okay, the brain. Okay, so we call it frequency selective network. So we need to have a frequency selective network to make or to make sure and we have an oscillation at the right uh, frequency. Okay, and that's something we can design ourselves. So basically we need an amplifier, we need an, uh, a selective or a frequency selective network. And of course we need to meet the Parkhausen criterion or the oscillation criterion where we need to have an overall gain or a loop gain of one and a phase shift of zero. That's for the loop gain. OK, so uh, so this is this is the two conditions that we need to or uh, we need to meet. First, we need to have the first shift of the feedback, uh, sorry, feedback, sorry guys, feedback loop to be zero, okay? And that's of course will give us the frequency of oscillation, okay? So we will do the analysis for the next oscillator and we'll see how can this condition helps us to find the frequency of oscillation. And then we go to the second condition or uh, uh, which is the magnitude of the the loop gain should be one, okay? And and that's obvious, Shabab, from the transfer function of the feedback system, because this is a positive feedback or a phase shift of zero. So we'll see a negative sign here, and then the second thing you need to make this one equals one. If you are able to do that, AF will go to infinity or AV will go to infinity, OK? Uh, yeah, so we'll do the analysis first to find the beta A or the loop gain. Then from there, we can find the phase where this beta uh, A can be zero, and that's the frequency of oscillation. And from there, we use the frequency of oscillation to find the condition of oscillation. Then maybe the circuit will oscillate, uh, but we need to meet the frequency of oscillation, the condition of oscillation to make it uh, uh, oscillating. OK, so let's start with the first one, uh, the OBAMP RC. This is under the group of the OBAMP RC oscillators. Uh, we don't have an inductor here, and we are using the OBAMP as an active element. Uh, this is uh, one of the also common uh, oscillators. Uh, this is the Vimbridge oscillator. It's called Vimbridge or Winbridge. That's fine. Both are OK. Uh, so uh, and the scientist is or the 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 the, uh, the one who invented uh, this circuit is called uh, Vin. Uh, and it's called bridge because of the structure of the oscillator. And of course, we know for the OBAMP RC oscillators, usually or always we are limited to the bandwidth of the OBAMP. So make sure you should of this note. Uh, um, that's something you need to have in mind when you are want or when you want to design oscillators for your application. OK, so uh, so let's uh, uh, ask ourselves always a Shabab, if you have an oscillator or if you have a system uh, and you want to see if this one will oscillate or not, you want to make sure uh, this can be an oscillator or not. You mean I mean you need to answer the question, will this circuit oscillate or not? Of course, this is obvious that we have a negative feedback here. So, so from here to there, we have a negative feedback, and usually, or most of the time, this is dominant. 
but we have a two uh, two here, uh, two impedances. They th that may shift. Um, let's see. Um, uh, uh, sorry. Um, yeah, uh, I made it. I made a mistake here. Yes, that's a negative feedback from here. But if you consider the Vx here, the phase shift from Vx to V out will be what is about because this is an uninverting amplifier from Vx to V out. So this one will be what. Will have a phase shift it? of zero or minus one eighty, or one eighty. Zero. Zero exactly, and of course we can keep our impedances. These two, uh, uh, they may not contribute to the phase shift or the overall phase shift. And if we are able to do that, now we can meet the frequency of oscillation. So sorry, the condition of oscillation for Barkhausen criterion or the first condition of oscillation. So let's now uh, analyze the circuit to find uh, the condition of oscillation and the frequency of oscillation. Then, my shabab, fill oscillators. You are uh, uh, enter. We are all interested to know the frequency of oscillation, tamam, and also the condition of oscillation. Now that the day you want to, your circuit to oscillate, tamam. So uh, let's call this one V X, and this is V O. Okay. And uh, first, I need to do what is about. What do you think? So I have two things here. One is the frequency of oscillation. This is one. Second is the condition of oscillation. How can I find the frequency of oscillation? From the Barkhausen criterion. We need to find the uh, beta and A. So we need to find the beta A or the loop gain. So the target here is to find beta A or the loop gain. OK, and then from there we can find what the phase of the beta A or the loop gain will be zero. And of course, if you satisfy this equation, you will have or you'll get the frequency of oscillation. This is the first. Uh, uh, I mean, this is the first requirement. Second, from there also, you can find your magnitude of beta A at the frequency of oscillation to be one. OK, so this is due to the Barkhausen criterion. And then two conditions. frequency of oscillation. The second one will give you what we call the of oscillation. Ish ma'naha? Ma'naha kam qiymat mathalan? مثلا كم قيمة ال R1 compared to R2 we need to make R2 مثلا uh, 10 times R1 to uh, to make sure we are uh, or we have a, a sustainable uh, oscillation okay and that's something we are interested to find so this is two so let's now find the beta A what do you think Shabab? without looking at any without doing very uh, Intensive details. What do you think of A, the the gain from V output to V X, excluding the selected network? الآن خل خل خلي شباب السيركت كأنها amplifier و selective network. يعني الآن you need to shift your mind or somehow you need to يعني the feedback circuit من أول كنا نقول إيش نبي نفصل the feedback whatever the feedback. But now imagine the circuit that you have an amplifier. It can be in a negative feedback. It can be in a positive feedback. It can be in any other in any other configuration, and then you have a selective network, uh, uh, a frequency selective network. Uh, it's obvious from here that where is your selective network, Shabab? Don't you think this is your selective network? Ali, مش موقف في positive side. It's okay, but anyway, I mean, maybe it can be. Uh, Connected for the negative, tamam, in general. Like in behind the circuit, yes, it is the one uh, seen here, and this is to call selective or frequency selective network, tamam. And its beta will be what? Will be v x over v out, tamam. So what about the a, shabab? So a, if you are now shabab, excluding the frequency selective network. 
يعني تخيلوا شباب بس الفريكوسي سيلكتيف نتورك مش موجوده وات ويل بي اي اللي هي الفي اوت على الفي اكس وات ويل بي اي ماينس ار 2 على بلس ار 2 اوفر ار 1 بلس بلس ولا سوري از ات ار 2 على ار 1 ولا في شيء ناقص 1 بلس 1 بلس ار 2 اكزاكتلي ذيس از نون انفيرتينج ابليفير سو اي will be let me call uh, so this is v out over vx with beta disconnected so this one will be one plus r2 over r1 and it's nothing but a uh, uh, non-inverting amplifier now what do you think of beta now what is beta شباب طبعا نسوي نفس العمليه كانها superposition عموما احنا لما نقطع البيتا من هنا او الفريكونسي سيلكتيف نتورك من هنا it will not have uh, uh, of course it will not have any effect to the a because the r out is almost يعني zero طيب what do you think of beta يا شباب so this is beta and this is will be vx over v out with um, a disconnected طبعا انا دو ايت يعني فيري سلولي هير بس ليتر يو كان فايند ات يعني انذر واي از تو جو فروم ذس لوب ذس بوينت يو جو اراوند ذا سيركت اند يو كم باك تو ذا سيم بوينت اند اوف كورس ذاتس يور لوب جين ات از ذا سيم ثينج يعني شباب اف يو جو هير وات از ذا لوب جين هير اف ذس از زيرو ناو اف يو ار هير اف يو ستارت فروم ذير اند يو جو اراوند ذا لوب ذس از ناثينج بات بيتا اي ات از ذا سيم ثينج اوكي واضح شباب But I'm doing it in two steps. Later, maybe you can do it in one step or like very, very quickly. Uh, depends on the, يعني ال, ال, how complex is your circuit. So what do you think of beta here? Can you apply a voltage division, Shabab? Rule? يلا شباب what is the what is beta here اللي هي الفي اكس على الفي اوت لاحظ انت كانك مقطع هذه كانها مش موجوده so i'm only considering the selective or the frequency selective network is it what half? is v x sorry even voltage division is it half one over exactly. two exactly which is what uh, i think it's half v x Uh, ليش في اكس؟ عندك تو امبيدنسز صح؟ زي البارالل والسيريز رايت؟ اه هذه بارالل اوكي. رايت؟ سو ذيس از كان اي سي ذيس از ناثينج بات ذا بارالل وذ ذا سيريز از ساتش؟ از ذات اوكي؟ يس. فولتج ديفيجن يا شباب. سو وات از ذا بارالل كومباينيشن؟ ات از ار وذ 1 over uh, SC multiplied by, uh, I mean, divided by the same thing. Sorry. So this is what? This is R over 1 plus SCR. And what is the series? So series will be 1 over, uh, sorry, 1 over SC plus R, and that's nothing but 1 over SCR over SC. Okay. And now I can apply it here. So let me call this one as star. So I substitute in star to find beta. Okay, Shabab. So I have A to be 1 plus R2 over R1. And I have beta to be, again, uh, the uh, parallel, here cannot R1 over SCR over the same, the parallel. هذا كلها البارالل رايت وبعدين عندك السيريز الزي اس which is uh, uh, let me go back which is 1 plus سي ار اوفر اس سي سو فار سو جود سو وات كان اي دو هير اي كان ملتيبلاي الاس سي من تحت عشان اسوي كومون فاكتور هير اند ذن وات اي هاف يا شباب سو ذيس وان ويل جو وذ ذيس ويل جو وذ تويفر هير And now I can have SCR from there, then SCR from here, okay, plus one over SCR all squared. So, 
OK, make sense to you? And now SCR will be, uh, let me just open the brackets here, 1 plus 2 SCR plus all squared. What I have here, uh, I have two H above from here, I have one from here, that's three. SCR plus one plus S squared, C squared, R squared. OK. And maybe I can even simplify the expression a little bit. So let's divide by uh, one over CR, SCR. So I, I take, I mean, cancel this one and then a little fill numerator and the same thing for the denominator here. So I can do what? Uh, one over C, uh, sorry, uh, this one will be one. And then I'm taking SCR Shabab as a common factor. So this is three and then one over SCR plus S, sorry, it's not squared now, SCR. Make sense? Yes, uh, clear. ولاحظ يا شباب البيتا هنا من اسمها Frequency Selective Network it's not our regular impedance uh, uh, خلونا نقول uh, uh, or resistive uh, kind of uh, network I mean feedback so we have now a frequency dependent uh, feedback uh, circuit which is expected which is something we want to have okay so now our target by the way to have the loop gain equal exactly one. so the loop gain what is the loop gain now so the loop gain now let's let me call it l come on so l for loop gain which is nothing but the same as b s and of course your a is not is not frequency dependent i mean i can i can have it as a okay so then this is nothing but one plus r2 over r1 over uh, three plus C S C R plus S C R one over C R sorry plus S C R. Okay. Now let's find the phase. So let's find the phase of this one and let me Shabab change it uh, from S to J omega because this one will be uh, uh, I mean uh, better to view. So uh, what will be the phase of this one? I will just write down the expression. Let me try try down the expression for J omega to me. So this one will be J omega. One plus R2, R1, three plus, Shabab, one over J omega. This is one over SCR. So I can write it as J omega SCR, right? And even I can write it as minus J Omega CR. Do you agree? Yes. OK. Perfect. So this one will be minus. J, sorry, J be confog. Huh? Okay. One over CR. And then I have plus J Omega CR. Obviously, I can take them as. Uh, uh, I mean, the, 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 the imaginary part here is, is obvious. So what do you think, Shabab, if I have, if I want my loop gain or the phase of loop gain to be zero, uh, what will be, uh, so what is the phase of the numerator here? The numerator is zero. The numerator zero because they are all real. We don't have a imaginary part. What about the denominator here? Initial phase has a complex, Shabab, complex number. If you have a complex number. Okay. LJ at Korkana 90. No, but, but, but even, I mean, what is the main, the main role of the complex number? And the 10 inverse of the imaginary ala? على الريال صح؟ so if you have uh, alpha j omega خلونا نقول so the tan inverse here or the phase of this one will be omega over uh, the, the real part or the imaginary over the real part تمام خلونا نسميها بشكل عام imaginary over real part okay so 
Do you agree, Shabab? I can have also l l l l l imaginary. So uh, if if I want to have l l l l l tan inverse of that, what is the imaginary here? Exactly. So this one will be omega one over omega C R uh, plus uh, omega C R. Then I cut the J H. I cut the J H. Common factor. Common factor. Okay. But and this one can be right here as to be over three. And this is. معلش خلونا نكتبهم جديدين. So the turn inverse here. Or uh, uh, what I can do here. So the the yeah, this one is the denominator, and then minus tan inverse, right? Of one over minus tan C R plus omega C R over three. Okay. Type. I need all of this. Okay. This is something. Uh, for the oscillation, I need all of this to be zero. So if I want to make this all of this to be zero, what do you think of this part? Shabab? Can be what? Or need to be what? Zero. Zero, zero. exactly. Zero. And then the argument here, the inside, the tan inverse of zero, uh, I mean tan zero will give you zero. So the argument will be zero. And of course, from here I can say that my the numerator here, which is CR plus omega CR equals to zero, which is the same equation. And then I can find my omega naught. Sorry, let me call this one omega naught here because I'm starting from here to be my frequency of oscillation, omega naught. And then my omega naught will be what? One over one over CR, yes. Okay. Do you agree? Wadah yes. Shabab is Okay. So this is the first one or the frequency of oscillation. Now we need to find the condition of oscillation. Is it a condition of oscillation? Beta A equal one. Exactly. So we need to have our beta A equals to one. Let's make a slide. Okay. Uh, oh, don't have space here. Malish, Shabab, I need to do it very quickly. So I can have a uh, copy and paste. And then I take this one off. OK. So now the beta A or the second, uh, I mean, the, the condition of oscillation can be found from the equation of beta S A, or let me just make it general, the L J omega equals one. Then we're going to have the H, the park housing criterion. Somehow I lose the H level, another monitor. Let's show KFTG. Okay. Okay, let me continue. Right. So the, the magnitude will be one. So what I have, Shabab, what is the magnitude? Sorry, this is the, not the magnitude, this is the phase. The magnitude will be one. And now I have one over a uh, one plus R2 over R1. And I can find the magnitude. So this is plus. Uh, let me take the J omega here. So this is one over omega S R minus. Uh, this one will be yes minus C R. And of course, this is the at the frequency of oscillation. So what do you think, Shabab, of this one? What do you think of the denominator here? Omega not is here. طلعناها قبل شوي. لو ميجناتي كولز سي ار. سي ار. What do you think of this term? زي زي رصار الجي. 
Exactly. It will be cancelled. صح ولا لا؟ Yes. Or oh, this is expected. يعني by the way, this is expected that the the imaginary part will be cancelled. And then what we'll have? We'll have one plus R two over R one over three equals one. And of course, from here you can have you will have R two over R one equals three. And from there, your R two over R one will be two. And the condition of isolation will be R2 equals 2R1. And usually it's not exact as 2R1 due to many, many factors. So we can have greater or equal to R1. OK, so R2 can be greater or equal to R1. So this is what this is the condition of oscillation. So to have your circuit oscillate, تمام at omega naught اللي طلعناه قبل شوي you need to have your r2 to be greater than 2r1 or يعني at least it is 2r1 طيب how can i change the frequency شباب of oscillation الان طلعت انت استخدمت الفريكونسي الاوسيليتر هذا بتطلع 10 كيلو هرتز تمام واحد ثاني يقول والله بطلع 5 كيلو هرتز How can I play with the oscillator to give me 5 kilohertz instead of 10? تتحكم في الار Exactly, the R is صح؟ هي الار is You have an R. You have your R available, and also you have your cabs available. So either you change your capacitors, or you change your resistor. Or it can be, I mean, both of them can be changed simultaneously. Okay, but usually in the practical Vimbridge oscillator. Usually these cabs are fixed, so the capacitors are fixed, and we are changing the R's. So this is our, these are variable resistors. So you can just uh, find or like use a potentiometer or a variable resistor, and then you can tune your frequency, okay? From 10 kilohertz to 5 kilohertz to 50 kilohertz up to infinity. Is that right, up to infinity? <laughs> Of course not, huh? It should be limited to the bandwidth of the old band. Okay. okay, so this is an oscillator. What is the, uh, what other limitations, Shabab, we have? Or let me ask you, Shabab, if I increase loop gain greater than one, what will happen? I would want to say oscillation, but this is the goal here. هو صار اوسيليشن ميبي ان ستيبل اوسيليشن اتس نوت ستيبل ممكن ناو يور بول از نوت اكزاكتلي ات جي اوميجا صح سو ات كان بي ايذر سو ات ويل ستارت اوسيليت اوكي اند ات ويل نوت بي ستينبل ات ويل كيب اوسيليتينج ات ويل كيب اي مين انكريزينج سو ذس از اتس نوت Uh, a sustainable or a sustain you don't have a sustained oscillation okay and also it can be uh, so uh, it can be the opposite i mean it can it may start oscillate and then it will be a stable system i mean it will be the opposite of oscillator okay so we need to make sure we are um, stabilizing the oscillation and that's why we are interested in the condition of oscillation طبعا uh, there are many ways to do the condition of oscillation or to make it يعني, uh, like almost uh, uh, close to 2R1. Uh, شباب, this is not, a, it's not practical if you want to go ahead and uh, stabilize your system every time. صح؟ يعني تخيل عندك راديو طبعا ما في احد عنده الان راديو <laughs> بس anyway. تخيل عندك راديو and every time you want to go ahead and uh, stabilize your oscillators inside uh, by changing the frequency manually. Uh, sorry, the R2, the R1 manually. Okay, and that's not not practical. So what usually we do, we apply what we call gain control circuit. So gain control circuit. Okay. And this circuit, usually we use uh, maybe diodes, some transistors, um, some maybe uh, other variable resistors uh, to stabilize the gain. We have sustained oscillation. Okay. From the beautiful thing about this circuit, the Vinbridge, 
they use sometimes if you look at the practical Vim bridge oscillators, you may see a lamp here, a bulb. تمام؟ فتستغرب يعني كيف how they are using a bulb here instead of R1. And actually it tends to be the bulb is nothing but a controlled resistor. لأنه كل ما current مر فيها تغير عندك resistance of the bulb. And now this bulb is designed in a way to make your control or your gain uh, to be controlled, uh, to give you a sustained oscillation. Or let me say it is designed to meet the condition of oscillation in what R2 equals to R1. To R1. تمام؟ وعلى فكرة الديستورشن هنا ممتاز جدا يعني في يعني أقصد it's, it's like uh, close to the ideal case. I mean, it's not now used. They used other ways like transistors and diodes uh, to make a better uh, like uh, gain control. But it, it's found to be like the best using the bulb. It is bulky and very old technology, but anyway. Uh, yeah, so this is one way to do that. But in general, we need to stabilize the oscillation using the gain control circuit. Okay. Another idea to use a control circuit, maybe this one here, you'll find it in the lab and also in the textbook. So this is one, uh, sorry, this is one idea of the gain control. Okay, and here you are implementing a kind of Shabab controlled resistor, but using a diodes, because those diodes have some like mechanism um, to make it, يعني, to make a, this resistor uh, uh, or to meet the condition of oscillation. And the other thing uh, for the oscillators, uh, what is the limit for oscillation? Now, if you meet the condition of oscillation, we have R2 to R1, and we have the frequency that is 10 kHz. What will be the amplitude of the output? The output here can be called amplitude from rail to rail, from the top to the from minus to positive. What do you think? VDD for the OBAM. Almost, صح? بتكون almost VDD or VCC خلينا نسموه نسميها تمام of the OBAM. So almost you will get an oscillator, and that oscillator will have a magnitude will be from VCC to minus VE. طبعا with some some like a voltage drop here, but it is very very close. طيب how can I make my own oscillator with an amplitude؟ مثلا انت تروح للمعمل تقول والله ابغى فريكونسي سانسويدل تطلع لي عندي 1 فولت. So how can I control my amplitude؟ اذا حطيت السيركت الشباب زي ما هي هنا بالفيم بريدج يو دونت هاف اني امبلتيود كنترول. اوكي؟ But there is another way to control the amplitude. And one famous way or like very يعني, useful and very easy to follow using a voltage resistor هذي, with these diodes. OK, and this is what we call amplitude control or amplitude stabilization. So you can find or you can use a Shabab R3 and R2. And usually, by the way, R3 is the same as R6. Yes, it is R6. Well, R4 is usually the same as R5. OK, so maybe I can go ahead and say this is nothing but R3. And this is nothing but R4. But what about the values of this one? You can find the limits of V output by finding a little voltage here or the maximum voltage across A and B. OK, and usually we call it L plus and L minus. A lower limit min fog, a limit min tight. So this is your sign here again. And it can be very close to the maximum or minimum. Very close, lower key that. OK, and then you can design your L plus and L, minimum, L negative based on these resistive uh, circuits. I think it's easy to find the L, L, L positive, L negative here, Shabab. It's just a resistive uh, uh, network. But the main idea here is to control the amplitude. Now, just a circuit heavy. OK, this one. And I give you the other circuit with amplitude uh, control. Obviously, the amplitude will be controlled there based on the values of R3 and R4. And here it cannot be controlled. You'll have 
a maximum amplitude or let's say uh, a rail to rail with all minus VEE to VCC amplitude. So you are taking the whole uh, amplitude of the signal. OK, and by the way, you can even change or you can even add uh, like a voltage. Uh, so the resistor uh, variable resistor here. OK, and then you can change the amplitude. And for example, if one volt, then I'll give one volt. If you want five volt, then I'll give point one volt and so on and so forth. OK, sure. OK, I hope it's clear. What else here? Uh, I think. Uh, طبعا why we need a شباب الكنترول uh, stabilization why we need to stabilize the circuit زي ما قلنا قبل شوي اللي هو الجيم كنترول سيركت this is one way one idea why we need it يعني خلاص انا اخترت 2 r لل r2 equals 2 r1 or at least يعني تك زياده عن 2 r1 and that's it we are fine we just run it forever what do you think يا شباب شرايكم يا شباب؟ why I need to have why I need to stabilize the circuit هنا؟ إحنا قلنا أوبام ممتاز وكابل في كابل باسيف ريزيستورز so I just go ahead and use مثلا إذا كان ال R1 1 كيلو 1 كيلو أوم I can use 2 كيلو أومز or maybe 2.001 كيلو أوم for R2 and that's it. Any idea؟ أتوقع عشان الفيدباك بوزيتيف بعد فترة تنخفض الشغلة. ايش ايش هو؟ يعني الاوسيليتور بعد فتره حيصير زي ما رسمت الرسمه الاولى في الاول <تصفيق> الاوسيليتور حيكون از ريكوايرد بعدين تدريجيا حيبعد بناء على ليش اللي غيروا؟ بناء على الكونكشن بناء على ايش اللي غير البوزيتيف فيدباك ولا؟ بالعكس البوزيتيف فيدباك هو قاعد يخبصه من ناحيه يخليه مور اوسيليشن يعني And that's something we want to have. What do you think of temperature effect on these passive elements or these active element? What do you think of the power supply? The can power supply 15 volt or minus 15 volts, and maybe there will be some variations. Hello, and an ideal 15 is about minus 15. Well, we can have a variation based on the until you are running this oscillator forever. And for your application, you want to run it for a long time. So will your 15 volts will be supplied always as 15 volts or a bit cool and a fee ripple for DC voltage? So as I'm going to be two or three, we can feel ripple, some ripple voltage with fill, 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 fill power supply. And also there will be some effect for temperature effect on your passive elements. And the capacitor or resistor, uh, due to the temperature, they may change or deviate from the previous value. And the same for the active element. So all of these effects, uh, Shabab, need to be accounted for. And usually we use these stabilizing circuits to stabilize our frequency facilitation. Okay, and this is exactly what I wrote here. So uh, make sure you understand why we need to stabilize the circuit. أكيد بيكون عندك فاي بيكون عندك ال ال component value بيكون تختلف from time to time due to the temperature maybe due to other effects in your circuit because they will have non ideal elements I mean parts of it or components at the end of the day okay and we discussed the control and stabilizing who are using limiters for limiting the output or maybe using the control resistor. For stabilizing the condition of oscillation. Okay, so let's go to the next one. Uh, any questions so far, Ishaba? No questions. Time. What do you think of this circuit? Will this circuit oscillate? And obviously, from the, the title, okay, it will it will be it will it will oscillate. So it's nothing but a phase shift oscillator, right? But why? Let me why? Uh, let me answer uh, or uh, let me hear you, Shabab, your 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 thoughts. Why this circuit will oscillate?
يلا شباب بنخلص اقل شيء هذه وات دو يو ثينك يا دكتور في نقطة ما فهمتها هاو كان وي ديتيرمن ويتش فيدباك ويل دومينيت اوفر ذا اذر سو يوجولي الريزيستف فيدباك ويل بي دومينانت اوكي الكاباسيتور ات كان بي دومينانت فور سم فريكونسيز اوكي So the resistive always is, um, more dominant than the the negative, the the capacitor or the capacitive uh, feedback or f- capacitive path. So for here, f- for example, here we have an element that is dominant. It's obvious that the uh, l- l- resistive uh, path. So if you consider Shabab Vx, let me call this one Vx. If you consider from V output to Vx, what is the phase shift? If you follow R, uh, I mean R to R path, I mean it's always negative feedback. حتى لو جيت من Vx من الجهة الأخرى, it is the same thing, right? But what will be the phase shift between V output and Vx here? Are they inverting or not inverting, شباب? Inverting. Inverting. معناته كم الphase shift? Minus one eighty. Exactly. Minus one eighty. تمام? Or one eighty. That's also also the same. So what do you think of uh, uh, of this circuit? يعني عندنا الآن the phase shift 180. وإيش the condition حق الوصلاشين؟ كان يقول لنا البركاسين إيش يقول لنا؟ The phase shift حق the overall loop gain should be zero. معناته I need another 180 coming from the selective network. Can I get that, شباب? Can I get the 180 or the minus 180? طبعاً كلها زي بعض الشباب. The minus 360 or 360 with zero كلهم زي بعض. So can I give the minus 180 from the selective network feedback or the selective network uh, circuit? Frequency, sorry, frequency selective network. What do you think? How many how many capacitors I have? Three. Three. كم maximum? 90. Minus 90. So I have for this selective or frequency selective network, I have the freedom to select a frequency that gives me a, a phase shift of from zero, it will not be zero, this is the ideal case, to minus 270. So I can select a frequency at the middle to give me minus 180. And minus 180 مع ال 180 او minus 180 it will give you a phase shift of zero. واضح يا شباب؟ So yes, I can have an oscillator out of this one. لو جاء واحد وقال لكم ايش؟ neglect ال- ال- this, uh, this part. يعني استخدم فقط two capacitors. Can I get an oscillation here? Yes. Yes. What do you think? So this is minus 180. It will be maximum frequency, uh, the maximum uh, or the phase at infinite frequencies. So if you draw it, it will be this one at the frequency or maybe uh, for infinite frequencies. And you, you will not touch the minus 180, actually. Usually you are very close to minus 180. So you are not satisfying the Barkhausen exactly. Tamam? So you need to cross the minus 180. You need to cross it at specific frequency to give you the right phase uh, for your oscillation. So for two poles, it's not enough for us. And it will affect the system somehow, but it will not enough to have a sustained oscillation. Sustained oscillation. So to have a sustained oscillation, you need to add another pole because this is a negative feedback. You need to have a three poles. And I think you still remember our discussion about the stability of negative feedback. It's not always stable, Shabab. We were going negative feedback stability is linearity is bandwidth is beautiful, everything And then we talked about the idea of having uh, 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 instability in the negative feedback systems. Yes, your negative feedback system may be, uh, c- can be unstable, if you have three poles in the system, you need to be very, very careful because those three poles may contribute to the phase shift and make it zero instead of negative 180. 
OK, so this circuit will oscillate because we have uh, or we can select a frequency at which the circuit will have a phase shift or an overall phase shift of negative, uh, sorry, zero. So let's now uh, find the frequency of oscillation, واحد, and the condition of oscillation, which is our second uh, requirement. And to do that, what is the target again, Shabab? What we need to do? We need to find. Yalla, Shabab, we need to find what? Beta will A. Al beta will A, okay? So we need to find beta A. Can you raise your hand, Yalla, Shabab, al Mujudin? Give it up. OK. One second. OK, uh, lower your hand, Shabab. Fine. So now um, uh, my target is to find the beta A. I'll start this and continue next time, inshallah. So the target here uh, is to find beta A or the loop gain. As we did last time, I mean, as we did for the Vimbridge oscillator. So let's do it. I mean, Let's do it and by, by doing the same. Let's now disconnect the circuit, the frequency selective network from the amplifier circuit. OK, and of course uh, you can see the amplifier. I mean, I can uh, do what is the other colors? I cannot have other colors. OK. OK, perfect. So. So this one will be what? This one will be my selective network. Frequency selective network. OK. And the other one will be my amplifier. So what will be A, Shabab? What do you think? A is what? Which is V out over Vx with beta minus disconnected. Exactly. So this one will be minus R2 over R. Because it's nothing but an inverting amplifier. OK. And what do you think of beta? So maybe beta will need more time to do that. Uh, I will start doing it and then we'll continue on Tuesday. So this is R2 because we have three different capacitors. So for beta, this is the beta circuit. I have, I'm doing it in the other way around. So I will start from R. Then you have a capacitor here, C. And then we have R, capacitor C and R capacitor C and this one connected to your V output. So what will I flip, ya shabab? I hope it's clear. So what will I flip, فقط بسيط, okay? Because I will go from here to the output, okay? واضح يا شباب ايش اللي صار؟ So what flip بسيط, inshallah I hope it's clear. So now what will be the current flowing and uh, sorry, through R, this R. The colors here changing. The colors have a problem. So what is the color? What is the current flowing here, ya Shabab? Okay. What is this current? Let me call it I X. What is I X? VX على R بدون تفكير وهذا ايش خلونا نسميه V1 this is V2 this is maybe I out this is I خلونا نسميه 2 okay and this is maybe I I1 it's fine I mean I1 is nothing but IX the same ها IX موجود خلاص ما يحتاج so now let's do KCL or let me let me ask you, Shabab, what is V2? So can I say that V1, sorry, V1, 
What is V1? Can I say V1 is nothing but IX, the current IX, multiplied by 1 over SC plus R. صح؟ هو الكرنت اللي مشي هنا بيعطيك الفولتج. مضبوط يا شباب؟ So this is what? This is Vx over R because Ix is nothing but Vx over R. لاحظ يا شباب التارجت الآن to have a relation or like kind of yes an expression between V output and Vx. فأنا بطلع ال V1 V2 in terms of Vx وبعدين بيش بطلع ال V output وال Vx مع بعض. Okay. Uh, we'll stop in, in 30 seconds. So this one will be uh, 1 over SCR over SC. Okay. So V1 will stop maybe here. It's nothing but Vx over, sorry, over SCR. Okay. We'll take it from here next time and we'll find uh, V1, V2. Uh, sorry, we'll find V2 in terms of Vx again. And then we can find the output in terms of Vx. يعني كنا نمشي بهذا الطريقة يا شباب. Okay? Any questions? دكتور. Yes, دكتور. تفضل. Is it, دكتور, practically achievable to have the balls exactly on the J omega axis? Yes. If you meet the condition of oscillation. If you meet the condition of oscillation, وهذا هم يت the condition of oscillation. If you meet a condition of oscillation and to get to put the pole exactly at the J omega, meaning that you have sustained oscillation. Because the doctor remember in the filter design, we were talking about that if we had the Q equal to zero for some non-ideality, the balls is going to be shifted to the right hand side. And non-ideality, so we didn't know anything. Does it apply here or not? Uh, it is the same thing. يعني أنت بالأخير the poles will be shifted, right? Will play here and there. يعني if you have an analysis, تكلمنا عنها قبل شوي لو مثلاً ما بقولنا بالأنالسيس خلينا نقول temperature effect. And it can be considered an analysis by the way. Temperature effect. عندك ال the supply voltage عندك صار في change somehow. تمام. في سام نويز كابلد مع ال supply وهذا نويز داخل على السيركت عندك. All of that will change the pole. Like if you have a circuit that control the condition of oscillation and make it exactly to R1, مثلا زي الفين بريج, يصير عندك the pole will go again to the J omega. يعني إذا كان عندك the S plane بهذا الشكل, the pole كانت هنا. Due to some non-idealities, طلعت هنا صارت. Until then, you have you need to have a circuit that it takes the pole again to the J omega. Uh, uh, axis and so on and so forth. For the kind of resistance here, we have the semi control yani for or stabilizing the pole or sustainable uh, oscillation. For integral pole, diamond al j omega. Tamam. Okay. 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 And then use for applications for the balls to be at the right hand side. Well. Uh, okay. Uh, right hand side, mm, I don't have something in my mind. Lano inter, uh, you are going, it's an unstable system, exactly unstable system, diamond. Uh, what maybe I think of is uh, the chaotic oscillators. If you end in a chase more chaotic oscillators, the chaotic hadoli and tibra oscillation, unexpected oscillation. So, man, few applications in the other mode, uh, تمثيل الكيوتيك سيركتس او الكيوتيك سيستمز بس الريال ابلكيشنز اللي احنا نعرفها وكذا اتس نوت دايركتلي ريليتد تو ذات تمام فخلينا نقول هذيك لدراسه امور اخرى اللي هي اللي يسموها ايش الانظمه الفوضويه الكيوتيك ابلكيشنز بس وي دونت هاف سمثينج يعني ناو كلير فور يو جايز تو توك اباوت فور ان ستيبل سيستم لانه اذا كان عندك رايت هاند بول ات از ان ستيبل سيستم But it's not a sustained oscillation. معنات عندنا مشكلة. Okay. Okay. أعطيك العافية دكتور. موفقين يا شباب. نسيم إن شاء الله تيوزدين.